the material arrived to us in five trunks. It's surprising to see uh, trunks from the 19th century that contain the correspondence that we began to unpack with assistance from our, our generous donors, uh, the great-great-grandsons of Miles Rock. Miles Rock was one of the members of the first graduating class at Lehigh, the first student in fact to receive a civil engineering degree in 1869. And this is just an amazing collection with so much research potential. It includes his diaries, it includes photographs, and um, perhaps most interesting is his Civil War uniform. I think that for many years this is going to be serving our community. Uh, critically to assess you know how people were living at that time and also thinking about the organization and Lehigh as a university. This is actually a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to see a collection that is this comprehensive. It tells us such an interesting story how a young boy from Lancaster County can go on to uh, not only serve his country but then also receive a college degree writing a thesis on civil engineering, uh, mapping zinc mines, and uh, then uh, graduating with an assignment as a Lehigh faculty member. He taught uh, civil engineering here at Lehigh for a year before um, moving to Argentina. He, he is, in effect, the typical Lehigh student. There are so many things we can do because this is such a rich uh, collection where uh, many times research uh, shows up from uh, not familiar avenues. And there are things that we're going to be doing in collaboration with many other faculty members. All of it is going to be a venue for research uh, in the future.